Hi. Um, so I got this package and I'm really excited about it. And we will be unboxing it. Um, this one is kind of a mystery. It took me a little while to like decode it and I still am not sure if I totally have. So if you have any information on this, like please let me know because um, a lot of stuff out there on the internet about it is kind of confusing. So um, I've wanted it since the first time I saw it and um, a lot of collectors and a lot of sellers seem to think that it's a rushed in. So I don't know if it was a collab with um, this brand. Uh, it's called... I think it's called like Fairyland Toy Company and um, they also made Saucy Walkers which I love like I would love a Saucy Walker but um, anyway the tag on this says uh, Fairyland Toy Company so um, I don't know why so many people classify it as a Russian it definitely looks like a Russian it's like got that creepiness about it and I really wanted like a Russian, um, but I wanted this one. Like this is the one that I liked. Um, one reason is because like all the really sought after ones are super expensive. And like, I just really liked the creepiness about this. And um, I mean, I think it's adorable still, but like, I like, a little bit creepy cute things so um this is like i thought that this was a russian and i wanted this like to be the russian in my collection but i still don't know if it is or not if it was just like a collaboration but after a while of like wanting it and only seeing it for like hundreds of dollars that i didn't really want to pay that much for it um, I mean, I think it would have been worth it, but I just didn't want to. Um, I started searching the tag and, um, I thought it was like hat or a rabbit at first. So I was like, okay, uh, Fairyland Toy Company, um, rabbit or Fairyland Toy Company, um, cat. And I wasn't getting that many, um, uh, what's it called? matches or whatever so um I finally found out like through some Etsy seller it might have even been this one I don't remember that it is like a gopher um this one doesn't have like it has like an apron I think that says Minnesota like Miss Minnesota um I don't know it was for the centennial I don't even know when that was in the 50s sometime but um it had like a pink bonnet and it had that like pretty um 60s like pink uh fabric and like the cheek um pink uh 60s cheeks that I really like so yeah that's what I really liked about it and like the bunny the Russian bunnies are really pretty and like cute but they're just not like creepy enough for me but anyway, back to my story. Um, this one doesn't have, um, I can see it a little bit. This one doesn't have um, the clothes, so I'm gonna have to find like a cute like pink dress for her or something. But um, it, I got it for like $40 and from a seller who didn't list it as a rushed in. It, she listed it as a, a Minnesota gopher. Um, so yeah, I guess you just have to like troubleshoot if there's something you really want and like this has a fun story and I still don't even know if it was like a Russian collab, but I think it's so cute. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I love this thing. I don't know what it is about it. I just think it's like so funny and so cool. But it's going to be like my little friend. And its cheeks are super pretty. Has both eyelashes. I'm going to clean it off a little bit. It doesn't smell or anything. Um, the fur is surprisingly like 
nice and soft. And I haven't even like touched a real brush in, so I don't know like how to compare that. But here I'll show you the tag. Um, it says manufactured for Minnesota Centennial Women's Division by Fairyland Toy Company, Minneapolis, Minnesota. So yeah, um, that is the the company that made it but so many people and even like real Russian collectors that I've seen videos for like call it a Russian so I have no idea if you know let me know but either way I feel like I got it for a steal at $40 when it was most of the sellers have listed it for like two three hundred dollars so and I love it like I think it's it's my favorite um rubber face plush so yeah I have one of these in my collection now and I'm super excited um I actually got something else that I have been wanting for a long time as well and it should be here tomorrow I think so you're gonna see that and I I've had a good week on eBay so yeah I might like try to there's really not like too much wrong with it like no patches or anything missing um the only thing that's missing is are its clothes so yeah um if you collect these let me know what you would do with it because I'm not gonna sell it or anything I'm just gonna keep it um but yeah it's like an awesome size it's like I I don't know you know when you see like the specs and the when it's being sold you can't really tell like you know, like, okay, it's 12 inches, but you can't really picture it. Like, this is, like, the perfect size to me. So, I love it. Um, but, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Have a nice day.